Hi guys, this is Soro. In this video, we will learn how we can create login and sign up form using Firebase in MIT App Inventor. So in this video, we will learn how we can code for login and sign up button because in the last tutorial, we have learned the design about this app, right? So let's see how we can do some code. Okay, so first we need to save the username and password because we have to create the account for the user. Then after this, we have to check the uh, check the username and password if the user is valid or not. Okay, so for that we need to create one more uh, here one more layout to redirect if the username and password is right. Then we have to redirect the person to the another uh, layout. Okay, so I'm going to make it visible off and use here one more layout that one is vertical arrangement and make this one hide you can redirect the person in the right uh, right uh, uh, path okay you can you can use your this functionality in many cases right okay so i'm going to change this background color to red and i'm going to use your one text or one label like this i'm going to make this one with this fill parent and change this text coding bus okay and I'm going to make this font size 40 okay and uh, change this color to white like this make this one alignment should be center make this vertical alignment should be center this one is also center like this that's very easy and simple way right now make this one visible off and make this one vertical arrangement should be visible on fine now let's go to the block section here whenever someone click on the login button okay it will vertical arrangement one you will find your login button whenever someone click on when login button dot click then we have to save the data in the uh, firebase like see here see there's null value here now let's save the value username and password if the user click on the sign up button so okay wait 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 we have to uh, save the we have to use sign up button here okay because we have to sign up first we have to done sign up it means we have to register the value okay so whenever someone click on sign up button then we have to save the username and password both for the user right so what i'm going to do here so whenever someone click on the button one sign up button button so click on firebase dv and you will see here call store value like this so drag and drop this and which tag we have to store it means lay text box one dot text you will see here find this one and which value we have to store it means the password password should be tag password text box one dot text this one like this fine now this will save the data but now we have to get the value also right so that's very easy now now let's let's run this app and let's see this uh, this one is working or not okay i'm going to refresh this app here like this and that's the uh, real time database here now i'm to click on username here Suppose that username is Saurabh and password is 1234 and I'm going to click on this sign up button. Let's see. You will see here Saurabh 1234. Right. So this one is working right now. Now let's focus on how we can retrieve the uh, all these info and check user is wrong or right. Okay. So for that, whenever someone click on button, login button, okay, this one, then we have to check the condition. I mean, we have to get the data first from the Firebase DB, okay. So I'm going to get the value. So click on the Firebase DB and you will see here, get value option. This one, call Firebase DB dot get value. And which tag we have to get? We have to get text box one dot text data. If suppose someone 
type here saurabh so we have to get the tag value if tag value is nothing then we will uh, return any none fine now let's check the data is fine if suppose someone uh, put the value uh, suppose harry and the, if harry is not in our database so we will display the error message right so when you find here when data uh, when 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 firebase tv dot data got value so you will see when firebase tv one dot got value so i'm going to make this one here make this here and let's see fine okay it's look fine now if so we have to use your if else condition click on control and you will see a if then click on maths and you will see here this one option just drag and drop this here then if the tag it means tag get so whatever uh, we get the value from the uh, get value it means one tag if suppose i am getting the this one tag it means sort of then we have to check the one more thing that one is the tag is equal to our on text box one talks text value suppose this one uh just copy this text box one dot text if the tag is exist then we will move in the password section so i'm going to use here one more if else condition if the username is right if we find the username then if we will find the username then we will redirect the password okay then we will get user one more function no just read this just copy paste this one then the value should be the value if uh, that one is fine now value should be text box password okay so i am to use here click on password text box and you will see a password one dot text the uh, tag value it means username is fine then we will check the value it means the password is fine then if both are fine and both are exist then we will hide this vertical arrangement one and display vertical arrangement two so click on vertical arrangement uh, one and make this one visible this one set visible false like this and copy this and paste here and make this one true and vertical arrangement two should be display now if this value is not matched and we will not find we are not able to find the tag and we are not able to find the password then we will just display one error message here this one text and set label so which level in which level we have to display value in the level 2 right i am going to make this one level 2 uh, color should be red and make this font size at least 18 go to the block and label 2 set label 2 dot text this one like this set label 2 if the uh, wrong value is then we will display wrong username and password like this simple let's refresh this app and let's try this one okay so you will see here login and sign up form username password login and sign up button let's suppose i just put here uh, suppose tcb that's my username and the password is 1 2 3 fine and let's i'm going to click on the sign up button let's see how it's work or not tcb 1 2 3 great now let's uh, run and to put here tcb suppose v okay and the password is something something d like this okay i have changed this username and password let's click on login button wrong username and password let's suppose i put tcb and the password is 1 2 then how it's work click on login the coding works right so that's overall app right so you can use this app in many uh, many functionalities right if you have any doubt you can ask me on comment and please 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 don't forget to subscribe my channel like this video and share this video okay 
Have a nice day. Be safe. Bye bye. Bye. <laughs>